And who would that be? It's me! Obviously. It's me. Oh, there's the apartment line too, please. Hi guys, recipe day today. Hey, what's up guys? Hey, what's up guys? So we're at the grocery store picking up stuff for recipe day. The deal of the day. 24 individual size packs of seaweed like this. And it's $8? I think that's not bad. Don't you guys love it when your dog greets you when you get home? I like your shirt, Rach. It's beautiful. Thank you. He's a beautiful man. He is a beautiful man. He's one of the most beautiful men to have ever graced this earth. Next to you. Aww. So we're back guys, we got some seaweed. We showed you earlier. We got some almond milk. Got some bananas. Oh my god, you know what I forgot to do? I forgot to show my banana experiment results. I have the footage. Okay, you know what? Insert banana experiment results now. Okay, we're back. Thanks for checking out our banana experiment, guys. Very nice package. Very nice. Try one. You guys don't know what these are. These are roasted seaweed. You can eat it with rice, or you can also eat it on its own like a snack. Good snack. Comes in a little container like this. Roasted and salted. This one has sesame oil on it. Mm-hmm. Pretty good. Well, it tastes amazing with rice yeah. and kimchi. Thank you. 
Well, here's some local Toronto news for you guys. Funny news. In Toronto, we have something called green bins. Green bins are what the garbage people collect when um, you're recycling your organic waste. Um, you know, orange peels, apple cores, etc. We've had them for about five years and, and a real big problem with them was raccoons would open them up. I like rip, raccoons. Rip yeah. open, you know. But they were clever, these raccoons. They're able to unlatch the latches and open the lids and go inside and then close them back. And I think some of them even close the, la the latch back as if like, right, as they're if, smart. They had no idea they'd been yeah, tampered with. Yeah. So after that, the mayor decided to create new green bins to call them raccoon proof. So they just were rolled out about a week ago. And this is already happening. They chewed through the top of the plastic, guys. It's crazy. So it looks like uh, we cheaped out on the plastic and they chewed through the green bin and we're still able to get into the organic waste. So way to go, Toronto. I think this was like a multi-million dollar rollout plan too. <laughs> they spent a lot of money on that. So guys, we're just sitting here chilling after breakfast and I was telling Dee about this new web series I found online called The Smash Brothers. It's a good show, it's about um, the video game called, you know, The Smash Brothers video game and how it became huge for Major League Gaming and stuff like that. And then I told Dee she should watch it. And then she said, what'd you say Dee? I don't need to watch it because I already know who's the best gamer. And who would that be? It's me! Obviously. It's me. <laughs> so, D is the champion Smash Brothers gamer here? Yeah. Wanna see my technique? Oh. How do you play? <laughs> I cannot, <laughs> cannot match that skill set no. right there. Cannot match. And then you drink tea after. Wow. For the magic of TV, guys. It's so smoky. I have to blow the smoke away so you can see the recording. The wake flavor can also be seen in the kitchen, as you see here. The flavors are in the air. You gotta capture them. Look at this cutie on our fridge. Our fridge is full of cuties. See? Here's baby Maddox. Here's baby D. Baby D's not focusing. Here's me taking a picture of myself with the Polaroid camera. So we just finished uh, making this dish and it's so good. Like we literally just turned off the camera. Actually it's still recording so they can do a double vlog. Oh yeah, that'd be cool. Double vlog, what does, does that it mean? mean? It's so beautiful. No, seriously, it's so good guys. Look how much we made. This plate was full and we've already eaten half of it. Mr. Billy, have a fake piece of meat. Eating banana ice cream and standing outside is one of my favorite hobbies. Do you guys like to stand outside and eat banana ice cream? I think you guys do. I would say yes because you're a very cool bunch. What's the weather like where you guys live right now? Is it nice enough to stand outside and eat ice cream? finished having lunch and decided to take a nap with my best buddy over here, Mr. VP. 
shit out with him on the bed here. He's so soft. He likes to give me kisses. Give me kisses. Give me kisses. Just like a puppy dog. They're gonna choke. I'm gonna choke. Don't choke on your food. Alright, so we have a kidney bean stew, kale and bean sprout salad with apples. Oh, apples. Is that apples? Apples. Oh, pears. Hash with some spicy Italian sausage in it. Mm -hmm. Carrots, celery, and some bread. Roch is going to continue watching the game, so I guess we'll call it a night. Thanks for watching, guys. We hope you enjoyed our video. Please like, comment, and subscribe. What is that? I don't know. What is subscribe? Check mark. Oh, check mark. Check mark. Subscribe. And as always, keep, keep on reading.